greatest economy in the history of our country. We had the greatest economy in the history of the world. And that strength let us get through this horrible pandemic, largely through. I think we're doing really well. Vaccines, by the way, had a meeting yesterday on vaccines. We're doing incredibly well with that. I think you're going to have some very positive surprises. And therapeutics, likewise, we're doing extremely well. Curing, we're doing well. I think those two words really blend in with each other. But uh, tremendous progress is being made on vaccines. In fact, we have ready to go in terms of uh, transportation and logistics. Uh, we have over 2 million ready to go if it checks out for safety. Uh, and it's also the nice part is we have f four companies, I guess you could even say seven or eight companies that are doing uh, some similar and some very different on the vaccine front and some similar and some somewhat different on the therapeutic front. So tremendous progress is being made on that. And I think even without that, and I have to say, even without that, and I don't think you're going to be having to use that in the future. Next year, unless something happens where the wrong people get in here, this can, this can turn around. Your 401ks will go down to numbers. If people didn't get rid of stocks in their 401ks, they're almost even. Think of it. With a pandemic, and with one of the worst things that's ever happened, no, we, our country has never lost 105 and people, whether it's World Trade Center, which was 2,900, or Pearl Harbor, which was less than that. We've never lost anything close to this. But it's not only our country, it's the whole world. The world is suffering so badly. 186 countries at this moment. And that affects us, too. But we're a positive force. We're the, the key to the world, in a sense. And uh, the fact that we're doing well, I see already they're starting to do much better in other parts of the world. That's a great thing, because we're working with the world. And we'll work with China, too. We'll work with everybody. But what happened should have never happened.